I'm Brody, and I am making ballistics gel out of Knox gelatin, a 32 pack envelope pack, and you just get a big bowl, a measuring cup, a one cup one, and then a box of gelatin, and you just tear all of them open and dump them in there. I did it ahead of time, so it didn't take so long. And then you get warm water, warm water. Okay, you get it nice and warm. You might, you have to have your stirring device ready. So, and you slow, slowly pour it in. Mix very slowly so you don't get any bubbles. You put eight cups of water in. Four. Seven. And eight. And mix slowly and make sure you get everything off the bottom. Keep on mixing until it gets really thick. Wait, wait. After you got it mixed up and stuff, <laughs> you will have, have a, like a squarish container, so you have a longer path. Make sure your container is big enough for it. Perfect. Now, scrape any like excess foam off the top. Get a wash it down the sink. Put it in your refrigerator. Nice and easy. And then that should be good. Now we wait. Okay, it's been 24 hours since we put the ballistics gel in the fridge. And getting it out now. We put Pam on the sides of this container it's in. It's pretty hard, I can't even. So, we put Pam on it, so you just have to squeeze and wiggle it a little bit. And it comes right up off the block of gelatin. Now let's shoot it. Okay, we are now outside. I'll be using my Ruger 1022 with three shots and I'll be shooting the ballistics gel. So hope it goes pretty well. 
I will be, hopefully you'll be able to see the bullets go into the gel. So let's see what happens. Okay, that was three shots. You can see, if you, yeah, you can see I hit there, there, and there. Pretty darn good. And that is awesome if you can see that. That is legitly cool. They went, they passed all the way through, but the bullet path is amazing. I'm using, I was using Remington 22 long rifle. 36 grain bullets, hollow point. That was cool. That's how you calculate a bullet's path through something solid, making it homemade.